Bulldogs, the math department would like to share some information for you that might be helpful when registering for classes this spring. Students need three years of math to graduate. They need one year of Algebra 1, one year of Geometry, and another year of a third math class. There are several options to take as a third year of math. They are Algebra 2, Personal Finance, Bridge to College Math, or Probability and Statistics. Hey juniors, sorry sophomores, this is not for you, but junior, you're getting ready to do a math class for your senior year and you have no idea what to pick. Have you taken Algebra 2 and it wasn't that good for you? Maybe you got a C or a D or even a F. Take this class, Bridge to College Math. I can help you save money on remedial classes for college because I can get you right into a college credit bearing math course by passing my bridge to college math course with a B or better. This is an awesome deal for you. No placement test. You can get right in. Skagit Valley College, we got an agreement with them. You can get right in with that. So come take my class, Bridge to College Math, learn all those math concepts you're not too sure about and get you ready for a college math course for after graduation. Got it? Hi, I'm Max from Probability and Statistics. In Probability and Statistics, we perform experiments, collect data, analyze data, and write conclusions. We talk a lot about sports, but sports knowledge is not a requirement. This class is an option for students that failed Algebra 2 and want a different type of math class to meet their third year graduation requirement. Or it's great for students that passed Algebra 2 or Pre-Calculus and are not ready for AP but still want to take more math. Probability and statistics and statistics can be useful for students interested in pursuing degrees in environmental science, social sciences, or some medical field. Algebra 2 is the next class that students typically take after passing geometry. We review Algebra 1 skills and dive deeper into functions and how they can be transformed. Students who plan to enroll in any kind of post-secondary education should take Algebra 2. This class is the gateway to the majority of upper-level math classes here at Mount Vernon High School and will help prepare you for more math classes at the community college and university level. Here's some other classes that are offered as math electives. Looking for more algebra? College Prep Algebra is a class for you. College Prep Algebra prepares you for college level pre-calculus with a review of Algebra 1 and Algebra 2 skills. Must be a junior or senior to take this class and have already passed Algebra 2. Join the fun today. AP Calculus is for any student who has an interest in pursuing science, engineering, or mathematics beyond high school. Furthermore, it is considered a gateway course and thus will provide a more impressive transcript. It is an excellent class to prepare students for the rigors of college. In addition, AP Calculus provides a solid foundation in mathematical reasoning and practice. If you enjoy mathematics and if you want to take a math game to the next level, calculus is for you. Hi, Pre-Calculus is a fantastic, challenging, rigorous course. Um, we build on concepts from Algebra 1, Geometry, Algebra 2, while exploring new mathematical ideas. Um, having a good basis in Algebra 1, Geometry, and Algebra 2 is really important for Pre-Calc. Pre-Calc is an elective math class, and it's a prerequisite to AP Calc. So if you want to take AP Calc, you should take Pre-Calc. Um, I talked to some of my Pre-Calc students, and they recommend that in order to do well in pre-calc, it's good to have a C or better in Algebra 2. Um, we also recommend just having really strong algebra and geometry skills, including um, factoring a quadratic with like an A value, so like 2x squared plus 3x plus something. Um, being able to know like your trig ratios, that sort of thing. Those are important skills that us pre-calc teachers expect you to know how to do. So, um, also pre-calc is going to help get you ready for college math classes, especially if you're going into a STEM field, um, STEM, science, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, science, technology, engineering, math. Um, so other advice, uh, when you're in class, take good notes, be studious, um, do your homework, study, don't procrastinate, make sure that any retakes you can do, you do them on top because my students are, they really recommend uh, not waiting until the week before finals. Uh, last thing, um, it is a challenging class. If you feel like maybe you're not quite there, but you want to challenge yourself, um, there's math science support that you can take. Um, it's a good thing to kind of pair with it to keep up with your keep up with your grades and keep up with doing your retakes and that sort of thing. So it is challenging, but like anything that is challenging, having success is rewarding. So um, if you have done well or at least good enough in Algebra 2. Think about pre-calc, it's an awesome, fun class. You'll learn a lot and it will prepare you for college. If you have questions, talk to your current math teacher or your counselor.